Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today we'll be reviewing Transformers 1986, 1980s Bone Crusher. So yeah, sorry I got confused there. My medicine's starting to kick in. I'm starting to get a little sleepy, but yeah. But we got Transformers Generation 1 Bone Crusher in all his G1 glory. And this is my fourth Constructicon out of the G1 set of Constructicons. Why not? Say why not. Now we're going to get down to some epic comparisons. Here is G1 Bone Crusher next to Long Haul. Leader Scrapper. And Mixmaster. And that's our last comparison. And now we get down to Transforming Bone Crusher. This is going to be a quick toy review today. First, we split the arms like so. Hold down the legs, like so. Fold this back. Flip up his head. Rotate his arms, like so. Put this up to form his robot chest. Flip up his head. Fold out his little robot arms. And pull out the feet. Not a bad little figure for this 1980s Generation 1 Bone Crusher. I love how this figure looks. I don't have his original gun, but I will give a random gun to him that he can use. I will put this Lego gun in his hands. So he'll have some sort of weapon to use. No, I guess that wouldn't work. I have to take it off camera. But here we got Generation 1 Bone Crusher armed up and ready to shoot some Autobots. And not a bad little figure from the 1980s. And now we get down to comparisons. Why not? Yeah, I say why not. And here is Transformers Generation 1, 1986 Mix Master, next to Bone Crusher. Why not? Yeah, I say, why not? And next to that, we'll bring out Constructicon Scrapper. If I can get him to work for me. But here's Leader Scrapper, the fourth member of the G1 Constructicon. Well, he's the first member of the Constructicons I own. Yeah, I say, why not? We'll bring in Long Haul. From Generation 2. Why not? There I say, why not? Okay. 
Okay, and here's Long Haul. Tructicon Long Haul. Next to Bone Crusher. I just love finding some 1986 Transformers. They are so much fun to mess around with from the 1980s. They're so easy to transform and easy to display. And now I'm only two bots from completing my Generation 1 Devastator. So by next year, we'll have a complete set of Devastator in 2025. Make sure to like, make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Now this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out.